we started the New Shepherd program with a clean sheet. We said, we need to carry people to space. What are all the possibilities? We went through 110 different iterations and designs. To eventually arrive at some fairly similar rocket to what Alan Shepard flew on, that was the right way to send people to space. The New Shepard flight profile, boost, and then re-entry of the propulsion module, and a very controlled landing that had never been done before. The onboard computer already has all of the algorithms and all of the code it needs to know how to steer it back. The key feature, being able to do everything autonomously, allowed us to do all these flights that we've done with great success. The shape for the crew capsule, we knew it had to be big enough to hold all the systems that would keep the crew safe, but we also knew that we wanted enough room to be able to really enjoy the weightlessness. We knew we wanted to have enough room for people to do a somersault. And then focused on the size of the windows, let people really experience being just a window pane away from outer space and being able to see the blackness of space and the beauty of Earth, that would be an incredibly exciting moment, that's for sure. <laughs> Common to all of those configurations that we would not compromise on were not just that it's safe, but that it's comfortable and that it's life-changing. <laughs>